Happy New Year! So I'm gonna start off today by going to buy something that I buy at the beginning of every year. Quick little outfit of the day. I thrifted this shirt years ago. This jacket's thrifted. I got it at a Goodwill last year. These pants are from Four Days. And these shoes are from BC Footwear. <laughs> Okay, here's the one I got. Nice basic gray cover. I do think this is kind of lame. Wins this week. But I like how the rest of it is. Anyway, maybe every three months or so I can write in here. Plus one YouTube subscriber. It's about 11.30 and I'm getting ready to see if I can get any lunch deliveries today. Hopefully I can, but who the hell knows because it's all totally random and super frustrating. Anyway, I'm going to set myself as available on Grubhub and see what happens. Later today I'm going to be going to a potluck at the animal sanctuary, so I need to leave myself time later to make cookies for that. So now, as usual, I'm faced with the choice of do I sit here and wait for an offer and not waste my time and gas driving around hoping for one, or do I go out to a hot spot in case that gives me a better chance of getting offers? Because sometimes it does and sometimes it doesn't. And then I just end up wasting gas and being out for no reason driving around like an asshole. Okay, it's 1.30 now. I filmed, edited, and uploaded an outfit of the day short, and during that time I got one unacceptable $5 Grubhub offer. So now I need to make these cookies that I'm going to bring to the potluck. I do not feel right. Okay, I'm making Mexican hot chocolate snickerdoodles. This is kind of one of my easy go-to cookie recipes. They do usually have cayenne pepper in them, but I don't have any. So I make them all the time without it too, and they taste just as good, so I'm just gonna leave it out. Okay, I'm gonna mix canola oil and sugar in this bowl.
half cup canola oil, one cup sugar. I almost always use just a little bit less sugar than the recipe calls for because you can. Call me what? Maple syrup, a quarter cup. I'm also not gonna use quite that much. Maybe like half of this quarter cup measuring cup. I wish I had unsweetened milk for this, but I don't right now. Three tablespoons of milk. A teaspoon of vanilla extract and a teaspoon of chocolate extract. Now I'm gonna add in the dry ingredients into here. One and two thirds cups of flour. Half a cup of cocoa powder. Basically everything that was left in this little thing. I'm just gonna kind of sift them together with the whisk as I add them. I'm not actually gonna sift everything. A teaspoon of baking soda. Chloe. I gotta make these cookies. Quarter teaspoon salt. Half teaspoon cinnamon, but I'm gonna do a whole one. About. All right, now I've got my dough. And the oven just finished preheating. I'm gonna spray my little baking sheets and I'm gonna roll the cookie dough into balls and then flatten them and then put them on the baking sheet. Can I fit another one on here? I think I can. They're not really gonna spread out much. here. Now I'm going to stick those in the oven for 10 minutes. Now while those cook for the rest of these, I'm going to make a little cinnamon sugar topping. I'm not going to measure it out. Just gonna put some sugar and some cinnamon on this plate. Just mix it together. I gotta give these a minute before I, well, a couple minutes before I put them on the cooling rack over here so that I can use these trays again. Okay, now for the rest of these, I'm gonna do the same thing I did before, except I'm gonna press them into this topping and then put them on the baking sheet. A 
I feel like I should have left more dough to do this topping with, but whatever. Now for these cookies that I didn't put the cinnamon sugar topping on, I'm gonna sprinkle powdered sugar on. Whoops, I just dumped a bunch on that one. All right, here they are, powdered sugar and the cinnamon sugar ones. Got a nice little variety to bring to the potluck, even though there's not that many cinnamon sugar ones. Checking out the food table. Are we play some bets? <laughs> Well, now they're being snuggly and stuff. Right. <laughs> Aw, best friend. <laughs> Fuzzy guy. You I feel like every time I've been you. here, he's crowing. You guys look really pretty. Hi, Deacon! Hi! Yeah, thank you. I got some kisses. Uh huh. Hi, Deacon. <laughs> Trying to eat my finger. Hi, guys. Hi. Hi. 
Hi. Ladies. Yeah, so Daisy's a head butter. I didn't know that, but I never come clean up. Uh, I don't clean up after the cows. I gave you a ton of pumpkin earlier. Hi. Hi, cutie. Someone's loose. Uh-oh. Well, I mean, <laughs> yeah. that way. So I've been available on Grubhub like most of the day while I've been editing and I've gotten two $4 offers. And it's one o'clock now, so I kind of don't really feel like giving any more mental energy to Grubhub today. <laughs> 